Here we go, we're going to find the gradient of a line. Uh, this line passes through these two coordinates. Um, what does gradient mean? It just means steepness. We're going to see how steep this line is. Let's have a look at the question. The actual visual look of the question. Here's our line. It passes through the coordinates we just mentioned, 3, 1 and 5, 7. Here are the two dots which represent those two points. Um, and we're going to see how steep it is, or the gradient. And how do you measure how steep or what the gradient is? You simply do the up distance divided by the across. So immediately I can tell you the gradient is 6 divided by 2 which is 3. The answer is 3 but how do we get to it? Um, well I can see this dot is 1 high and this dot is 7 high because look that 1 represents how high the dot is, the y part of the coordinate and this 7 represents how high this dot is which is the 7 also the y part of the coordinate. So you can see quite clearly from here to there is 6. That's 6. And also from here to here is 2 because from 3 to 5 is 2. Um, if you had to do some calculations um, here's a summary of it. If you had just the numbers and you didn't want to draw the picture which is fair enough um, you could simply do the y values take away from each other? Let's scroll it a bit down here. So uh, the y values taken away from each other, which I've got in green, 7 take away 1 is 6, and the x values taken away from each other, which is 5 take away 3 is 2. Um, the y's divided by the x's, simply, which is 6 divided by 2 in this case, which is three like we said earlier. So finding the gradient is very easy. Um, even without drawing the picture, simply do the y, t the difference, take the y's from each other, divide it by the difference in the x's, you get the answer. Um, here's a grey bit. What is, what is that all about? That's just if you happen to do it the other way around instead of 7 take away 1 you do 1 take away 7 and instead of 5 take away 3 you do 3 take away 5 you get minus 6 divided by minus 2 which is also 3 so it doesn't matter which way round you take away the numbers uh, here is a quick summary the question said find the gradient or the steepness you find the steepness by doing the up distance divided by the across distance or the difference in the y's divided by the difference in the x's which we've got here the difference in the y's divided by the difference in the x's which is 6 divided by 2 in this case equals 3 and it doesn't matter which order you do it